Hey, I'm Derek Kirk, and I'm gonna show you how to make a cool retro style sunset loop. We'll be cruising along the road past low poly mountains forever towards the sunset beyond the city skyline. <laughs> I just love this style and this aesthetic, and I think you're really gonna have fun creating it too. Whether you're new to Cinema 4D or an experienced user, you're gonna be able to follow along step by step as we create this loop, as well as hopefully pick up on some tips and tricks along the way. The first part of this course is going to be for all Cinema 4D users. We're going to focus on creating a customizable seamless loop. We'll cover creating geometry that's specifically designed for a loop, as well as how to create that cool low poly look. We're also going to learn the power of cloners, as well as some animation tips for that perfect loop. Beyond that, we're going to use Redshift to create lights, cameras, and materials for our scene. We'll also cover some helpful render settings, as well as motion blur and the Redshift post effect settings. Lastly, we're going to take our rendered animation into Adobe After Effects to add some heat waves and some final touches. <laughs> Whoa! This is going to be totally radical! Let's get started!